hey guys what's up how are you i hope that you guys are having an amazing day today in today's video we're going to be doing two looks one palette using the pat mcgrath mothership seven palette i'm going to use my primer from p louise to prime my eyes i will link everything down below in the description area just in case you guys are interested we're going to start with the first shade which is veloria and i'm going to be using this fluffy brush to really work it into the crease from the inner corner to the outer corner and just building that intensity that i like now using the extreme mahogany shade i am going to really focus that in the outer corner of our eye to really intensify this look but still make it nice and wearable now using rose dusk i am going to take that into the inner corner of our crease and i'm going to be using the same little brush that we were using before and really making that shade stand out going back with valoria to blend everything and using also valoria to really smoke out the lower lashes now i'm going to be using love lace which is this beautiful taupey shade in the outer corner of our lid which it looks absolutely stunning but this shade right here is everything which is the astral solstice and we're going to add that to the inner corner of our eyelid i mean look at that shine so beautiful then going back with all of the previous shades just to intensify the look a little bit now using this beautiful iridescent pink 003 in the inner corner of our lower lash and really just packing that shade and now going with the skin show nude which is really beautiful as well but a little bit more subtle and i'm going to add that to the inner corner and also the brow bone i'm going to clean up using the same brush that we used to prime our eyes and i'm going to tie line using the patrick ta brown liner it's a little hard i'm still i'm not sure how i like it i really don't <laughs> but um i'm using it anyway i'm going to curl my lashes and then add the pat mcgrath mascara which is one of my favorites the drier it gets <laughs> the older it gets the drier it gets and the more beautiful your lashes actually look with this mascara i absolutely love it really really nice it makes my lashes look long and i do not have really long lashes but this mascara really does a really good job and i'm going to add it to the lower lash as well and here is the first look it is gorgeous super wearable in my opinion but what do you guys think all right now moving on to our second look we're going to use the shade valoria and i'm going to create a halo eye so i'm going to really focus this color in the inner corner and outer corner of my eyelid and really intensifying that color little by little and just creating the shape that i like and now using the shade rose dusk i'm going to do the exact same thing i'm going to add it to the outer corner of the eye as you can see here but it's going to go a little bit lower than the previous shade and I'm going to add this to the inner corner of my eye and just intensifying this color to your liking as well. It is a really nice, beautiful shade and you can also add it to the lower lashes and just creating and mimicking the same thing. With a fluffy brush, I'm going to go back with Beloria because I feel like I just really needed to blend this look and really make it look nice and seamless. Now using the star of the show, which is Via Rose Venus, we're going to add that with our fingers in the center of our eyelid. I mean, the shift on this eyeshadow is absolutely stunning it's really really beautiful as you can see i love the lighting that i'm using because you can really appreciate the color of it it's really nice and beautiful i'm just going to go back with the previous shades that we were using in the center of the eyelid in the very center i'm going to use astral solstice as you can see here with a pencil brush really nice and beautiful and for the lower lashes right in the center we're going to add the refined gold 002 now using the iridescence pink 003 i'm adding it to the inner corner but i didn't really like the way it looks so i actually went back with skin show nude as you can see here i'm going to add it to my brow bone as well as in the inner corner and then i'm going to add the iridescence solstice or astral solstice <laughs> right in the center pat mcgrath why you make it so difficult for me to say all the names of your eyeshadows <laughs> anyways i'm curling my lashes and i'm using the same items that i use to tie line which is the patrick ta and the same mascara this is it for the look you will see the second look in a little bit which one was your favorite the first one the second one don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you guys have not already and also leave your comments and request a down below thank you so much for being here and i'll see you guys next time bye